All right, we're gonna head back out here to Blue Thunder. This is the old pontoon boat that we fish off of out here on the lake, and we're gonna take the boys out here and the wife and see if we can get us some channel cats on the sudden impact fiber bait. Everybody, we're not going to show you all the catfish we caught on the fiber bait today, but what we are going to do is show you how to bait up using the sudden impact with a bare treble hook and how to position your boat to set up in front of these bushes and these shallow flats and these trees and try to get these catfish to come out and hammer that bait. Uh, it's a lot of fun, it's easy to do, and you can do it anywhere in the country. Okay, I tell you what we're going to do. We are going to pull up to this island right here and we've got some waves beating on the front of the island uh, the, some of these trees are flooded uh, the lake's coming up right now and a lot of times in the this is May it's about the, the 22nd of May these catfish will move up into these uh, flooded trees and feed right before they start to spawn um, here we are on the GPS and and uh, we're in 36 foot of water right now but when I anchor the boat we're probably only gonna be in about three or four foot of water and I'm actually going to be casting the sudden impact bait right up into those trees and then we're going to surround the pontoon boat with a few other rods just to see if we can find any active catfish here on the flats. Not real complicated, there's places to do this all over. Uh, a lot of lakes have these islands and here in Oklahoma you sure got plenty of wind so the wind will really help. Okay, my son Hayden's going to show you how the uh, sudden impact fiber bait works on a bare treble hook. Hayden, let's get that uh, baited up. What you do is you stick it... Speak up a little bit where they can hear you, bud. What you do is you like, um, you stick it in the, bo the dish, and then you push it down, and then you cover it over. Cover it up a little bit? Yeah. The hole? Yeah. And then you yank it up. Okay. And then you can Let's put a little bit more on it. Yeah, push it in there again. Put it over it. It's kind of sticking to the stick, isn't it? Yeah. All right. One more time. That was a bare treble hook. So one more time, and we'll be loaded up. There we go, folks. We're ready to cast that up in the bushes and catch us a catfish. been here probably if we let this place kind of settle down we might have been here five to ten minutes and caught two fish already we haven't done anything real special that is a really nice channel cat we're just throwing that fiber bait up into those green trees up into the bushes while we was getting so windy uh, it, it just about blew our anchor ropes loose and it's so windy that uh, Patricia couldn't video uh, record me right here uh, the audio was terrible, but uh, that's a, a nice catfish, and this is very typical of what you can do. Uh, just look for a, a shallow point, a shallow flat, the wind blowing into it, uh, the bushes, the trees, logs, what have you, and get that fiber bait cast up in there and try to get those catfish to come out Got and eat one. it. That one had a bite. That one had a bite. All right. Well, I don't think he's on a monster cat, but we got us one, didn't we? He ate that old fiber bait. Got him, Oi. Pretty nice channel cat. Woo -wee. All right, we'll get him off the hook and get another one. Hey, everybody, that was a quick little video. We caught six or eight catfish. Just a great way to spend a couple hours out with the kids, and this is not difficult. We got anchors, we got fishing rods, sudden impact fiber bait. We're using the wind to move the scent 
uh, up in those trees. Uh, get you some sudden impact. Get you some sudden impact treble hooks. And get the kids out on the water. The more you do it, the more you're going to learn and the more you're going to enjoy it. So for next time, I'm Jeff at Team Catfish. Please watch all of our other videos. They'll truly help you catch more catfish. Thanks for watching.